way to it all. Oh, we are here with another Minecraft video, and today I'm going to show you all three cool ways to fast stack in Minecraft. Let's get on with today's video. So, fast stacking is like really mainly used in like Bed Wars and Sky Wars, that's why I kind of have like a bed here. It can also be used in like the, the game The Bridge, so you can like make a new bridge. So, yeah, I'm just, just going to show you all some cool things, and also I just want to say happy holidays to everyone and enjoy your holidays. So, let's get on with today's video. So my first way to really fast stack is it's not that fast and it's really it's kind of it can be used very good if that's really if there's like you don't need to go too far for stacking but it's mainly just to just do something like this is the fast stack. I mean it's much faster than going like this which is pretty slow. But yeah, the way you do this is basically you want to get to like the edge of the block so you see how my blocks like gets white which means it gets highlighted that's the block you're on you want to like you so my pointer is like on the edge of the block and when you place it you can place at the edge of the block without crouching because you could see i'm not crouching at all and you can place blocks like this i mean it takes a decent amount of practice it took me a little bit to start to do but you can start to do stuff like this it can be crucial on many times, but just try to aim at the edge of the block where your, like, pointer is. I guess the plus sign, if you see what I'm talking about. You just want to kind of get there, but you don't want to go too far and you could fall off. So you don't want to do it, but you got to constantly click, and you can't hold in the clicker, sadly. Or your mouse. <laughs> but, um, yeah, so that's kind of number one. It's very crucial. I use it a lot. You might see in my Bed Wars videos that I use this a lot. So yeah, that's the first way to fast stack. And yeah, let's get on to number two. So apparently this is called God Bridging, and I don't understand why, because it's not even as, it's not even the fastest stacking, but it looks god, I guess you could say. So basically the what what you want to do for this is you want to so you count one, two, three blocks. Which direction you want to go and you just want to look which direction you want to go in. Then you count one, two, and then on this third block you want to place a block like this. So you see that there's like two blocks right here. Then you want to go on your blocks, jump on this block, keep your, your mouse and like where you look as far back as you can. Like you don't want to be like this, you want to be as far back as you can. You can't look any more behind you like this where your head's completely face down. Then you just want to start, you want to click the backwards, and then you start to, you got to hold in your, you got to hold in your place block button. You just got to keep holding that in, and then eventually you could just start getting the combo, and then you can start jumping. So yeah, it's, 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 it's pretty cool. It looks amazing. I mean, so it takes a lot of practice too, don't get me wrong. But yeah, remember, so we get one, then you get two blocks, and then you want to go. And then you gotta face all the way down, and then, oh, I fell. <laughs> Alright, let me just go back up there real quick. Game mode C. And then, game mode. Aim mode S. But yeah, you just really just gotta get the hang of it. You get one, and you just go back. Like, as you can see, it takes a lot of effort and practice, but once you get it down, it's really cool. You just gotta have one here, one, two, hold your down all the way back so your head's facing completely down, and then you just gotta walk backwards and hold in your place block button. And sometimes it may not work like that. It may not work like that, because sometimes it just doesn't work, sadly, because it's god bridging and you can fail a lot, actually. It happens to me a whole bunch, so don't get frustrated if you fall a lot, just, there's all the better ways to stack, like this one that I taught you guys. So yeah, you just really just gotta get the hang of it, and then, really, that's really all you gotta do, and it's decent, it's medium speed. So yeah, that's for god bridging, so let's do number two. So basically, this is basically the same exact bridging as like the god bridging. So basically, you want to get one, then one, two. Same thing for god bridging. Two blocks blank, one block up. And you really just gotta hold in your clicker. Make sure you're faced all the way down where your head's completely down, except you're not backwards this time. 
and then you just gotta walk forward and keep placing blocks. <laughs> As you can see, I fail a lot too. It's the same thing with God bridging, except like it can get complicated after a while. Not after a while, but so you really just gotta go. You don't have to be all the way down. Just make sure, like, you could go up a little bit, but you don't want to be facing completely down for this. You just want to, so you see how I'm highlighting that block, and then you can start to do this. It's more complicated, I guess you could say, but like, so one, one, two, you one block up, and then you could just, you look, so look at this block first, the one you're about to place a block on. So you want to walk forward and place and hold in your place block button like this. And then once you start doing that, you can get started in a sprint and you can start jumping. You can actually also do some pretty cool tricks. And like like I said, you can start doing this and then you could just one two one. Um yeah, so you can start to like once you once you get this lock in the game recognizes you got it in so ready so if you just start walking and i'm still holding in my place block button but it still recognizes that the combo is in for comboing placing the block and you could start to do this too and yeah you can fall sometimes just don't get frustrated if you keep falling i mean after a while you start to really get the hang of it and it's really crucial once you get really good at it. As like as you can see, I have not mastered it yet either. But I mean, after a while, you can just start to get the combo and get the hang of it. And you can start rushing people in bed work before they can even get a bed to fence and be like, "Hey y'all, I'm just gonna get your bed real quick while you're in the shop." And yeah, boom, got your bed. I got your bed. And yeah, it's pretty cool. Just get. It's, don't get frustrated, I know it may be very hard, but after a while you can start doing 360s. Like what I just did right there. I mean, it takes a lot of practice, trust me, I sometimes can't even do it, not even fall for fast stacking. I mean, the god bridging too is like, this really just looks cool, it's not really made for anything in particular. It's just cool to have another cool way to stack. All these are used in different timings, like this is just really to get to a place that's not too far. This best one is to get to like places that are far. I mean, yeah. So yeah, everyone, hope you all enjoyed. Um, please do a lot of practice and hope you all enjoyed. Please like and subscribe for more content like this. And yeah, happy holidays. Bye bye.